Hey everybody, Sub Games here, and welcome to part two of Undertale. So I know that um, you guys were probably expecting a uh, mod quest today, and sorry, but that's gonna have to be postponed. I was pretty busy this week. I couldn't start it, and it's I didn't want to rush it. Uh, but Undertale, it's short. I just recorded it and edited it. It's it's not not as much work needs to go into it, so I thought I'd just do this quick so that you guys wouldn't be without a video today, even though I missed Saturday and Friday's video. Um, and those videos, you guys are just going to have to wait another week, sorry. Like, I was busy this week, was not able to get them done, and that's that. So, we are going to be continuing our Undertale Let's Play this week, this week, this week, this week. So, last time, we fell into this underground, and... Who is this? Could it be my favorite character of all time? Yeah, so anyway, that last time, fell into the underground here, and uh, we met Flabby, Toriel, here, who's this? Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force? No, let's leave him be. Oh, I think we gotta, I think we gotta move him with force. Alright. Da, 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 da. Here comes Naps to Blue. Yo, what up, Naps to Blue? We're gonna we're gonna cheer you up. You look a, a little sad. You give you give Naps to Blue a patient smile. Heh. <laughs> oh man. No, don't do this. You're my favorite. Oh. Ow. Um. Let's flirt with Naps to Blue. I just wear you down. We're really not feeling up to it right now. Sorry. Oh, by the way, guys, uh, I did say I was going to try and point out every single song because I love the soundtrack so much. This is Ghost Fight. Um, let's, let's cheer him up again. You told Naps to Luke a little joke. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Dodge all of his tears. He's so sad. Let's cheer him up a little more. Naps to Luke wants to show you something. Let me try. Whoa, he's crying upside down. I call it Dab Dapper Luke. Do you like it? Of course I do. That is amazing. Let's cheer him up. Oh, gee. I, I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Thank you, Naps to Luke. Alright, what's over here? Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Let's see. Leave seven gold in the web? Oh, uh, yeah. Some spiders crawled down and gave you donut. Leave 18 gold in the web. I don't have enough. I can't buy it. Yes, spider, whatever it was. What is this? Did you miss it? Spider bake sale down and to the right. Got meat food made by spiders for spiders of spiders. Hmm. Oh, hey, hello, Froggit. Ribbit, ribbit. I heard using F4 can make you have a full screen. But what does F4 stand for? Four frogs? I have only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling, to say the least. Ribbit. <laughs> uh, silly froggit. But well, where is the third frog? Ribbit, ribbit, I have heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think of that? That's very helpful, froggit. It, it is rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day you'll have to do it, even if their name isn't yellow. Uh oh, what's this? The Vegetoid came out of the earth. Fresh morning greens? I don't know what he said. Ah, I took a little bit of damage. Let's, uh, let, let's talk. Plants can't talk. Uh oh, uh oh. Plants can't talk, guys. What are we doing? Let's, uh, dinner? You pat your stomach, but you joined the offer for a healthy meal. Eat your greens. So we gotta eat the greens. There's a green, there's a green. Get the green. I got it, I got it. Vegetroid cackles softly. We can spare him. You won. You earned 0 XP and 4 gold. Alright. Where's the third frog? It's... Isn't it like somewhere in the wall? I saw something about this. It's somewhere in the wall, right? What's this? Wait, Migos crawled close. Oh, we can spare it. We can spare it. Okay. Alright. He's just doing his funky fresh dance. Oh! That does a lot of damage. Oh, we can spare him. He doesn't have a care in the world. Alright, let's spare him. Migos, you, you cool. So we're not going to waste too much time on these frogs. Oh, ring. Hello! I just realized that it has been a while since I've cleaned up. 
I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying around here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. What? Leave room in your pockets for that. Click. Alright, what's over here? Hmm. There's just one switch. Alright, there's only one. So, let's walk through here. Oh, what's this? Luke's drew near. Let's, uh, check Luke's. Don't pick on him. His family name Eyewalker. Please don't pick on me. I won't pick on you, dude. You seem pretty, you seem pretty cool. Don't pick on me. Finally, someone gets it. Whoa. Oh, ow. Ow. Alright. Let's, let's spare him. We could, uh, we could use some monster here. Some monster candy right by now. Wait, the monster candy. You recovered 10 HP. Oh wow, that's pretty good. <gasps> no, not the spikes. We're gonna have to... We're gonna have to... Whoa. Go down here. Maybe there's something here. Alright, there's nothing in that room. Let's check this... Let's check this next room over here. What's this? Oh, the Vegetoid. He came out of the earth. Let's do dinner. Pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Alright, we gotta... We gotta eat the greens. <laughs> Greens are so hard to get. All right, dinner. Got your stomach. Fetch right off. Help. You know, eat your greens. Oh man, <gasps> got it. I got, I got the greens. Yeah, let's bear them. All right. Hey, look, there's Nasty Luke. There we go. Uh, now we're gonna. Let's try going down here. Oh, there is one switch. There we go. Looks like there was another Vegetoid in that other room. Uh oh. <laughs> I made two holes in the ground. All right. We're gonna walk down here. I just saw maps to move, so I'm gonna I'm say hi. Hello! Uh oh. What up? I fell down a hole, now I can't get up. Go home without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. <laughs> Goodbye, Naps to Luke. Naps to Luke is like my favorite. Alright, we can leave now. Wait. Wait, no. We're supposed to go into here. The far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation in perspective. Okay. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. Alright. Let's see what's this. There's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. Alright. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. Alright. Nothing happens with any of these switches. There we go. Now we can get through here. And what's, what's this? It's a switch. Press it. Yes. You hear a crackling noise. What's this? What? What? Oh, we just fell. Oh no, now we're back up here. We've gotta be careful what switches we press. And what does this one do? Oh um, no, it's the exact same thing. You noticed there was a blue switch behind the top pillar. I did notice that a little bit ago. What's this? Our HP is getting a little low. Let's eat some monster candy. Wait, monster candy. All right. All right. If you can read this, press the red switch. All right. So we're not going to press any switches except the red one. Is this a red switch? It's a switch. Press it. Yes. We heard a clicking sound. We did it. No, 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 no. No. All the way back to the beginning. So now we're going to go through here. And we're back over here. Alright, what's what does this sign say? If you can read this, press the green switch. We're not gonna click on it. Oh, somebody gets it. Is this a green switch? It's a switch, press it. You hear a clicking sound. Yes, that must have been the green switch. Good job, Will. Alright, what's in here? Let's see, we got that stuff up here there. What's over this way? Ribbit, ribbit. Just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out of here just a while ago. Oh, Toriel was in here. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Ribbit. Oh, uh, what's out here? Oh, look, you can see, you can see a lot of the underground from here. What's this? You found the toy knife. Oh, okay. This is, um... Hmm. So, 
or knife, weapon, attack, three, made out of plastic, rarity nowadays. Well, let's, let's equip it. We're going to equip the, the toy knife just in case anything happens, you know? We don't, just in case we eventually get in any sort of a situation. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. <laughs> How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? <clears throat> oh man, my throat's so sore from all this. There, there, I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. Oh my gosh, this is bad. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to su surprise you like this. Er, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. All right, we're gonna we're gonna come. We're gonna come with into the house. Or, seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. We're gonna save here. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here, so I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Wait, living here? We're gonna be leaving, living here? This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. I'm getting pats on the head. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. <laughs> Alright, what's in here? This is cool. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. Oh, we slept in the bed and look, there's some pie. We found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Nice, we got the we got the bee scotch pie. An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kids' shoes in dis in a disparity of sizes. Oh, we can turn on the light. Wait, does turning on and off the light change it from home to home music box? That's cool. I never noticed that. What's this? Alright, that doesn't do anything. What room is this? Oh, this must be Toriel's room. Just regular old bucket of snails. <laughs> Toriel's small chair. Its name is Cheriel. <laughs> Definitely bigger than a twin size bed. It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown, oblonging seed pod, sea pods, known more commonly as water sausages. Alright. You peek inside. Scandalous. It's Toriel's sock drawer. <gasps> we looked in the sock drawer. That's so... Wait. You can't stop looking at the socks. Oh, that's terrible. Oh my. Alright. So what's this? Room under renovations. Alright. Oh look. It's you. It is me. Alright, we're gonna go see what Toriel's up to now. Hey Toriel, what's up? Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also pre prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to, to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Nothing. When can I go home? Guys, we're going to have to go home at some point. Let's let's ask. What? This, this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Sure. Here, here is an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails have a chainsaw-like tongue called a redula? I didn't know that. Interesting. Yeah. Well, bother me if you need anything else. Alright, I will do that. What's this? It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fear fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. What's this? The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. Alright, yeah, we don't want to get hurt by those. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You can put your hand inside. That's nice. This little table there. What's all this? The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. <laughs> the stovetop is very clean. Toriel must use fire magic instead. 
That's cool. Tori's got biometric. There's some white first stuck in the drain. <laughs> For some reason, there's a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder... I think the only place we haven't checked yet is down here. What's down these stairs? It's awfully quiet down here. I think you should play upstairs instead. Um... What's, what's that about? Let's, let's try going down here again. It is dangerous to play here. Let's try one more time. It is drafty here. You will catch a cold. She keeps dragging us away. What's, what's down here? It's dusty here. You will catch a cough. She, she keeps using all these excuses to keep me away from the basement. What's in the basement? There's nothing to see here. Are there any more excuses on top of that? I feel like there is something to see here. Do you want to read a book? No, we're going to keep going. We're going we're to keep... Going. I do not like the game you are playing. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Toriel asked us to stop. Let's just see... Let's just ask her about leaving, because we have to. What is it? How to exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. I'm gonna follow. I, I, I'm gonna follow. I have nothing to do. Maybe she went... Er, you know what? While she's busy doing something, let's go downstairs. Uh -huh. Oh. She's downstairs. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. One way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No, no, we have to leave at some point. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. No, no, I'm not going to my room. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Alright. You want to leave so badly? Hmph. You are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh, and this song's heartache, by the way. It's not my heart aching. These are some of the intense feels that this game has. Huh. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Oh! Whoa! Fireballs! Fireballs! Lots of, lots of fireballs! Alright. Gotta try and spare. I wanna play Toriel. Um. Toriel prepares a magical attack. Oh! Ow! Toriel's acting only. A lot of dot 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 dots. Whoa! Whoa! I'm actually taking some damage here. I need some monster here. Whoa! Whoa! Ow! 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 How am I supposed to avoid that? Toriel looks through here. Whoa. Whoa! What are you doing? Whoa! Ow! Ow! That didn't... that didn't work at all. Toriel is acting over there. Attack or run away! I'm not going to attack you, Toriel. No. Oh my gosh. I'm actually taking a lot of damage. The way the monster can't be. Whoa! Alright, Toriel takes a deep breath. What are you proving this way? Whoa! Ah, oh, we gotta, gotta avoid the attack. Toriel prepares a magical attack. Fight me or leave! No, Toriel, I'm not gonna leave. Toriel looks through. Oh, uh, we'll see the spider come up. Whoa. Whoa. Toriel, there's magical attack. Stop it. I'm not doing anything, Toriel. What are you, what are you talking about? Right. Stop looking at me that way. Whoa. Can't get hit by enemies that might do enough damage to take us out. Nothing we can use right now. Toriel is actually Go away. We're all 
lot of food. We better not get hit, guys. They only do one damage. Alright, then that's not too bad. Oh, man. I can't dodge that. That is impossible to dodge. Alright, back in the Oh, yes, guys, we did it. From here on out, the attacks don't do anything. Oriole, let's see. Alright. I know you want to go home, but... But please, go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. Haha. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. Oh man, these feels. My feels, man. Guys, these feels. These, these are some real feels right now. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. And the hugs. This is so sad. Oh my gosh. Goodbye, my child. Oh man, my feels right now. Uh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> uh, my gosh. My feels. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave through here. So guys, I think that this is where I'm going to end the episode. Uh, please leave a like if you enjoyed this episode, and if you want more Undertale. Please do subscribe if you haven't already. I do other games, mostly Minecraft, and I try to upload daily. Um, yeah, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Okay, bye!